the commodities are diving into the red for a third day, and Heidi Kuch is in Sydney with the latest heights. Good morning, Haslinda. I certainly wore the right colour today. If you look at the board of the ASX, this is pretty much what you'll see. Mostly red ink, but there are little spots of green. CSR is Australia's biggest sugar refiner, and it's one of those little green shoots after announcing it'll spin off its sugar assets. I'll have more on that on, in a moment. Let's have a look at the resources stocks first, and certainly pretty ugly. BHP Billiton down by 3%, Fortescue nearly 4% lower. The benchmark index is into the red by about one and a quarter percent. Elsewhere on the market, there seems to be a bit of an IPO theme today. Rio Tinto may spin off its US coal assets in a public offering to pay down debt. Rio, of course, would have preferred to sell the coal mines to a single entity that would have avoided the hassle of putting a full corporate structure and management in place for the IPO, but they failed to find a buyer. And in what would seem like a logical demerger, building products maker CSR will spin off its sugar and renewable energy businesses in two separate I IPOs. CSR shares are surging on the news, up by six and a third percent today. Stronger sugar prices globally made it a good time to sell off the sugar business. But has Linda, how and why a sugar company was under the same umbrella as a building products maker? I'm still a little bit confused. Maybe they were trying to sweeten think, the deal for their fibrous cement customers. I don't know. <laughs> I, I want to hazard a guess. I think it's to do with diversification. I mean, if one industry doesn't do well, it can always rely on the next. And commodities always a good bet. What do you think? <laughs> well, maybe. Maybe people, I don't know, build at, at different times than they eat sugar. <laughs> I don't know. It's kind of <laughs> Give it a think, Heights. Thank you so much for that.